Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a video basically showing you all of the things I've purchased for my cruise that's coming up. It is in 30 days and I had to go buy a few things for the cruise to prepare for it. So I wanted to kind of show you like my haul, my cruise haul. Um, I know that I was supposed to be doing <laughs> a everyday makeup look today. Um, I was going to post it, but I wanted to get this video up first because my cruise is like coming up and I was just like, you know what? I want to get this one up first. So my everyday makeup look will be coming up next week, but I'm so excited to show you guys all of the awesome freaking things that I got. I couldn't get, I wanted to get like a ton. My, my goal was to get a ton of new clothes for the cruise. But like, if you haven't seen my life update, I'll put it here for you. Um, finance things have changed. So your girl's a little broker than she usually is because um, I'm down to one income. So I kind of just had to make do with just a few things instead of like a whole new wardrobe specifically for the cruise. And that's fine. We're here to make adjustments. It's fine. Also, if it lighting looks different, I try to do more of like a natural vibe for this video. So tell me what you think about it. If you hate it, I can put my studio lights back on and ju that just be that. But I'm trying to make it like a more natural situation. I'm also chilling in like this new chair I got. I'm putting the footstool up. Cause it's like chill. It's like just a chill video. Like it's not makeup or anything. So I just wanted it to be a chill vibe, but that is what it is. I also, I got this chair for free. This is a gaming chair with like a footrest and everything. Like it leans back for free. I got it for free on like Facebook something or other. The first thing I got was four luggage tags. Like they're hard case luggage tags. This was definitely one of the things that what I did honestly was I went on to Amazon and I said cruise must haves. I've been on a cruise before, but it was very, it was a long time ago. It was actually for my honeymoon. And so I kind of was like, I don't know what I need. I don't think I have the things that I need. So I decided to just look it up on Amazon. I literally said cruise accessories or cruise needs and it just gave me like all this stuff and then TikTok helped me too so I got luggage tags and me and my cousin we're gonna be in the same room so I kind of just got like two of everything for her and I so I did get these pelican marine waterproof phone pouches these were probably the most expensive thing I had purchased I think this was like $30 but there's two of them in here but it's like it's pretty cool so pelican makes a, like a lot of uh water stuff and water sports stuff I dropped a little, comes with like a little keychain or uh, lanyard, that's what it's called. Um, but they make like kayaks, they make a lot of different stuff, but I don't know if it's the same Pelican. I don't know. I don't, I don't know, but it's really good. This was one of the top rated. It's a little bit more of expensive than just the one you kind of slide in and it's plastic, it floats. So if like, for whatever reason, while we're, um, cause we are going snorkeling, if I drop my phone, it will float. This is kind of like a, like squishy. So it'll float instead of my phone sinking to the bottom and me never defining it again. And then it seals and you can also use the camera here and the camera here, it's clear. So it does come with two of those, but that was definitely something that was on a must have. And then I got this iWalk. This was all over TikTok. So I had to get it. It's the iWalk um, 4500 docking battery for the iPhone. Um, I got it in white. I don't have it in here because I used it for my concert, but it was pretty cool. Like you just charge it and then you can use it up to three different full charges. So I got that so I can have that with me like when we go either throughout the day on the cruise and I don't want to go back to the room and charge my phone or if we are at port and I obviously don't have a charger. I got me a beach bag. It is just like an olive green and white coat. Pretty big with roped arms. I got us lanyards with little ships on them. One, one is pink, one is blue to hold our sail and sign cards. Basically your sail and sign card is what you use for everything to access your room, to charging on your account. So I got that so we have that because they want you to carry that everywhere. I got poopery because if it gets stinky, cruise, if you guys have never been in cruise cabins, they're very tiny. There's not like a lot of air ventilation going on. So just in case, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? I got Dramamine for those of us who get motion sickness. I also got motion sickness patches. I don't actually get motion sickness, but like you never freaking know and I wanna be prepared. So this is a port 
and it is a cruise safe one you have to get the cruise safe ones the surge protectors or they will not allow you to take it on the ship so i'm going to keep it like in this exact box so because it says non-surge so they don't freak out but because you only get like think it's like one outlet per cabin i got me some water shoes so these are cool water shoes. They're not like back in the day. Remember those ugly water shoes that we used to freaking wear? Ugh. They were like colorful and they had like the black netting on the toe. These are more like discreet. It almost looks like a sock, but it does definitely have like a rubber sole. So I can wear them off of the ship if I want to instead of like sandals, or I could just obviously carry them with me. I got those. I got me a little travel razor, which to be honest, this was like just a just a fuck it, I'm gonna buy it. Because you don't, I could just have brought my own razor. It's a free, they're not that big. But I thought it was so cute and it comes in its own little carrying case. So I say, you know what, I'm getting it. And then I got a first aid kit, hello. This thing, I actually had to use it because I needed a band-aid the other day. But it is like stuffed to the rim full of all different stuff you can think of. And I feel like this is gonna be, this is gonna be what we require the most. Lots of drinking, lots of fun time. And then I got three individual makeup bags that are clear, three different sizes. I also got a shoe organizer so I can hang it on the back of the door, which I'll show you on the vlog because I am vlogging the whole trip. It's gonna be, cause it's a seven day cruise. So I'm gonna vlog Sunday to Wednesday and then Thursday to Sunday. So that way I can kind of split it up in two and it not be like an hour long vlog for you guys. But this is the shoe holder. It organizes your shoes in your room. After I'm done with it, I'll probably keep it for further like vacation stuff but basically all it does is it organizes like your sunscreen your beauty care your hair care because you like i said you really don't get a lot of space and then i got magnetic hooks because everything basically in the cabin is metal that way we can hang like our towels and wet clothes and stuff like that but these hooks are real fucking small it's the ones they recommended so that's everything i got from amazon <laughs> now we're gonna get into what i ordered my feet are up on this stupid pedestal, so it's hard for me to bend over. Everything I ordered from Shein. This is basically like sandals, clothing, etc. Because I really don't, I don't have a lot of that kind of stuff. Um, just because usually every summer I try to get new summer stuff, which again is gonna change like life has just changed so the things that i used to do and i currently do are gonna be a little different but the first thing i got were oh, these are cute as shit were these shoes they are a size 38 to 39 i don't know that was just recommending it to me which i think is like a size seven seven and a half but like how cute is that this is so they're like robe material. These are gonna be so cute and I'm gonna wear them with like, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know yet. Like my swimsuit maybe, with like my painted toes and my little tan skin. It's gonna look so cute. This is so soft. It's like, it is like a robe material. I'm trying to get my face out so it'll like see just the shoe. But these are cute. Actually, these turn out to be a lot cuter than I thought. I think that if you have really big feet, no offense, um, these may not be, they might kind of look like, like clown shoes, but for those of us with the tinier feet, I think they're gonna, they're gonna look really cute. And then I got these little Birkins. These are what I call fake Birkenstocks. Um, that's all I wear, like in all my videos, if you see me, they're not Birkenstocks. I'm not paying $100 for sandals that are uncomfortable to wear. So I get them from Amazon, but I got these from Shein in a size seven how cute white is obviously my gonna be my go-to color if you haven't noticed my toes are gonna be white obviously but these these are actually nice these are nice they were not very expensive either but these are rubber so they're probably not gonna be realistically great for when i'm like at port and having to walk a lot but definitely gonna be a vibe with an outfit for the boat these are supposed to be like I think like the fake Yeezy sandals, Yeezy, Yeezy. Yeah. My mouth does this thing and it has my whole life where it just kind of does whatever the fuck it wants to do. So when I pronounce things and it comes off weird or like my mouth doesn't move when I say stuff, that's why. I don't know. I don't know if I should have went to speech therapy as a child, but I didn't. So here we are. Okay. So these are supposed to be Yeezy-esque ones. You can tell they're fake. Like these are like 
these are not great quality shoes, guys. But <laughs> they're shower shoes. That's what they remind me of. But they're a vibe. They're a vibe. I'm gonna put them on my feet. Oh god, I almost not me. Oh, they fit. Ooh, they're nice. They're definitely not like clowns. But these are gonna these are gonna be really nice. All white shoes. Those are cream. Cream. Let's see. What is her dish? What is yours? Oh, this is my two piece set. So this is, I try to get like thin clothing because your suitcases can only weigh a certain amount without them having to like charge you more and a, a bitch is broke. So like you can't be charging me more. So I got me some thin clothing, but this is a crop top and like a dusty blue. And my daughter Madison picked out this color and it came with, oh, these shorts are gonna be a little bit bigger than I wanted. I wanted them to kind of be like, kind of like, tight you know what I mean <laughs> they're not they're gonna they're gonna be baggy but it comes with pockets and this is actually really nice material but they're gonna be a little big so this is cute so it's like a set a whole set with the white shoes are you kidding me I cannot wait for this freaking cruise you guys you have no idea and then I got this top which I'm just gonna wear with some cut off jean shorts and it's just like this very obviously I'm gonna close it more than that I mean unless I'm feeling risky that I'm just not but it's so it's almost like a I want to say like a mustardy yellow it's a little bit brighter than a mustard yellow but it's got these flare sleeves it's definitely see-through but I think if I wear like my swimsuit underneath it it's gonna be really cute and then it just gathers and ties so I can cross it over but I think this is gonna be really really cute with a pair of jeans I think I got something in here for my daughter so if it's my daughter's I have to give it to her I'm still sick so I'm trying not to cough while also trying not to lose my voice and now I'm losing light and I'm just like this is not working for me day, day two video fail <laughs> so this is just like a maxi dress it's pinstriped it almost feels like sleepwear like pajamas um but it's very through through I'm gonna have to wear like my swimsuit under it. It slits on one side and I'll post a picture of what it's supposed to look like. And I just thought it was gonna be, I don't know. It's exactly what I, I thought it was gonna be, but it's just like a tank like this. And I'm gonna accessorize it with some shades and a cute little like phone purse. And I don't know if I'm gonna wear, I think I was gonna wear white Air Forces with those, but I don't know yet. Okay, so this is another dress I got. And again, my daughter Madison and her friend McKenna helped me pick it out. So hopefully look cute in it and not a rumpity dumpity mess. This is going to be so cute. Oh my God. It's see-through. Oh my God. <laughs> of course it's see-through and I'm so curvy. Like I got the curves. So it's going to be, it's going to be a little bit tricky. I might just wear my swimsuit again underneath everything. That way if someone sees through it, I could just be like, it's just my swimsuit. It's fine. But it's a short little dress. Oh it's kind of torn here I have to cut that instead of ripping it but it's like a baby doll dress it ties right here at the chest area and it just has like wrinkly wrinkly what is that called there I won't say wrinkly because I don't like how that sounds ruffles ruffly straps but it was between this one and a black one and they said definitely this one for the cruise I I actually love this. This is going to be really cute. And it's short. It's short for my booty. I did it on purpose. I want my boat to be bouncing around. This is a three-piece swimsuit. I'm literally making a mess in my bedroom. <laughs> so this is a three-piece swimsuit. It comes with... Oh, why is this so long? Comes with a bottom that looks like it has a very long crotch area. That's fine because my butt's going to lift up most of it. But it is just this really cute like camel brown color and then this is the top which is like a bra swimsuit which now I'm kind of regretting because I don't think my boobies are gonna fit in that little thing uh -oh. I thought it was just no hell no I thought it was just gonna tie around it didn't say it, it was a cupped swimsuit because the problem is you didn't ask what my cup size was so like this is so cute too. So it goes like this. It can either, I think, tie above you or behind you, but I'm a little concerned because my gigantic boobs are not going to fit. They're just not gonna fit in here. Like that's not, I'm gonna be all, all boobs out, 
All boobs out. That's fine. But I'm gonna try it anyways. I'm gonna try to stuff these bad boys in there anyways. And then it comes with this cute cover which is like a jacket and then there's the sleeves and it's obviously see-through but this one's supposed to be see-through and it matches the top and then I'm gonna wear the cream sandals and this one's definitely gonna be like on the ship day at sea or whatever when I'm at the pool. Okay here's another swimsuit. This swimsuit I'm the most excited for. It is a one piece. Your girl doesn't do one pieces very well because she's thick but I saw this and I'm gonna put a picture up because it looks crazy but this is what it looks like. Honestly, this isn't bad. It is a little see-through. So I'll have to let you guys know how it is once it gets wet. But it has the cups. But it also has, it doesn't have like the hard cups where you can kind of decide whether, how much boob you want in there or not. But it also ties mid-stomach. But you can choose how tight it is because of the strap. So that's what I thought that one was because that's kind of like if it fits your boobs, it does. If it doesn't, you're screwed. Where this one can be adjusted. So I love this one and I can't wait to try this one on. This one actually, I'm very surprised at how nice this is. I love this for me. The other one, not so much. I'm not here for the cups because I feel like then... I'm being put in a box where like if I don't fit it I don't fit it so this was supposed to be like a if you know from like back in the 90s like this is like a halter mm -hmm. I know you guys remember these and I'm also gonna wear this it's like a crop with a pair of cut off jean shorts that's like my go-to so I'm gonna show you upside down but it's like that it's really like nothing honestly I don't know if I'm gonna be able to wear it because that's gonna cover all of like my boob and then nothing else. So yeah, I don't know. I got, the problem is my chest, my my chest area um, has a lot of land. <laughs> I don't think that top is gonna cut it. I will give you guys updates, but yeah, I think that one might've been a fail. What in the God is this? Oh, this is, I got a one shoulder bodysuit that's all this is it's very see-through but it'll do for what I need it for I have these like um they're those like flowy pants they're like real flowy and tropically I think they're these I think they're these and so I wanted like a bodysuit with it and this bodysuit goes like sideways that's nice it's not bad their bodysuits are okay I've bought them before sometimes they're too big and then sometimes they're too small and too big is okay because you can kind of tuck it in your bottoms too small is a problem because you go to sit down and your butt just pulls that and it snaps open and let me tell you what if you have never had the crotch of your bodysuit so tight that it snapped back open you don't know the pain, okay? That thing, the one time it did it to me, I was at work, I sat down in my tight jeans and my tight bodysuit and it snapped and it hit the side of my crotch. And I said, mm. <laughs> it's like going yell, I was in my office. <laughs> it wasn't pleasant, all I'm saying. Probably TMI, but it was not fucking pleasant. What in God's name is this? Why did I order? Because I do the things I do. This is not for the cruise. This is just another black bodysuit because um, I do that a lot. I love black bodysuits. But this is just a regular long sleeve black bodysuit. I love their black their bodysuits, man. For the most part, they're a little see-through. But for the most part, they're really nice. But so. that is it, guys. I know I kind of ran through this. But I'm so excited for my cruise. And I wanted to show you all of the things I've gotten. When I'm packing, I'm probably going to vlog as well. Just so you, can, you guys can kind of see what I'm taking and what I'm not. And I'll probably go through and pick out outfits with you guys. So you can see, like, what I'm wearing. And then, obviously, throughout the cruise, you'll see that. I hope you enjoyed today's video and cruise haul. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up button for me before you leave and as always guys I love you I'm so glad I'm back and I will see you guys on the next one bye